Hello, my name is Lucia Hernandez Rodriguez. I'm a student from the first grade of primary education. And in this video, I'm going to answer three questions about my final exam of research and ICT. Let's start. Before starting the university, my personal learning environment was influenced by the use of Instagram to see photos, Gmail to send emails, Twitter to post my opinion and see others, YouTube to watch videos and Facebook to see news. But it changed when I arrived at university and my teacher explained how to enhance my personal learning environment in order to improve my digital teacher competence. With this gain of knowledge about Web 2.0 point tools and resources, a world of opportunities is open to me. With the knowledge learned at the university, my personal learning environment has increased in many ways. I have learned how to use Twitter, Flipboard, Instagram and Facebook in a more effective way, not only to upload things like tweets and photos, but also to follow people that I want to be informed about or to catch up with the news. Besides, with Drive, Gmail and Dropbox, I have learned that I can keep on the cloud resources that I have used in class and also share data and information with other people. Geniali and YouTube are 2.0 point tools really interesting to develop with the students. As I have used them many times in class to make presentations, videos, graphics, maps and so on, it could be an interesting tool to learn how to use it properly in order to develop my digital teacher competence. Finally, I believe that Blogger, WordPress and Pinterest are useful to enhance in my personal learning environment because in them I have the opportunity of uploading all the information that I collect or the different resources used in my work. Besides, during this course I have used it not only in ICT and research but also in school organization. About the people that could help me to improve my TIDA, I have divided into people that is close to me and people that I have known about them on Twitter. Alejandra Navarro Hernández is my cousin and she is studying the same degree as me. For that reason, she has did this project before and she could help me to develop the idea and activity. Teresa Hernández Ruiz is a fifth grade teacher from the school Nuestra Señora de Los Ángeles and she could help me to develop the competencies of the activity and to give me an academic point of view. From Twitter I have chosen. Janoin is a teacher of biology and a researcher that could help me to develop my TIDA because she can help me to look for information more accurate about the different living being kingdoms. Juan San Martin is a science teacher that defends the flipped classroom, a way of acting in class really useful to use in the way I explain and develop my TIDA. Hector Montagudo is a language teacher that focuses on e-learning and educational system realized via internet. So this work is useful to know more about it and how to applicate it in my TIDA. For all these reasons, I believe that I deserve an aid because along this course I have included a web 2.0 tools in my PLA that could help me to improve my DTC. I also develop my technological skills and all those resources allow me to use them not only in ICT but also in other subjects.